Connect the foot tube sets with the rear bottom tube following the arrows. Put that in, push that little button down, boom. And take this, put that in, and boom. All right, step three is putting this thing in. Take that, put that in. I'll just take this and put this in. Snap, real easy to put together. There we go. So now you have something like that. It looks like the way that you raise and lower this before I assemble it, is you grab these little sides and lift it up and down. So when that says step on bar when you adjust the height, that doesn't actually allow you to adjust the height, that just keeps it solid and stable. Load the joints of the upper bumper for bassinet into the lifting tube as directed by the arrow so that the marbles on the joints may be ejected for reliable connection. There's a little piece right in here that we're actually gonna put on top of here. Okay, so when you put those pieces on, they're only gonna go on a certain way automatically. So now you're gonna take this with those little pegs down and it wants me to load the guardrail with this facing up. And you can only be put on one way. Put it in, snap, put it in, snap. That's the only way it can go in. Insert the welded short iron supports of support into the plastic cement on the tube set as directed by the arrows. Underneath here, you will see these are the plastic cement things that they're talking about. So we're gonna wind up putting this guard thing right underneath there. Okay, this was a bit confusing, but I did insert this bottom part into the little pegs, went into the little cement portions. You can't pull those things out. If you had to spin it around, you could literally take this off and spin it around. I have to literally take this back out and I've got to set it so that this thing can actually be zipped. As of right now, you obviously cannot put this over that and zip it because this is in the way. Take this thing out. That's why that's removable, by the way. And then I think I've got to feed it through here. It didn't really say anything about that, but I think that's the only way to do it. A little confusing. There we go. All right, so I've got that fed through there. This is exactly what's supposed to happen. It took some brain work there to figure that one out and then put those back where they were before. Now you can zip this on top of that. So that's the installation of this bassinet. In order to lay this down over to the side, it looks like what you have to do is unzip this and then unzip this side, open these up, and there's a little button in here you push. It's just a little pull button and it pops out. Slide it back, slide it up. That goes like that. That hangs down. So now you can access your baby on the side of the bed. These straps literally wrap around your bed so that this thing will not fall away from your bed. So you do those straps, they go all the way around your bed and you would strap them in and lock them in on this area right down in here. And also these little things are to be used to keep the bassinet a little secure. Comes with a little baby mattress and a little uh, mattress cover as well. I appreciate Sink sending this to me. I think this is a great product. That is the assembly of this thing. So there you go. Hopefully that helps you.